Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Robin and today we are going to switch out my summer into my fall wallet and then we are going to take savings challenge challenges that I finished in August and reallocate those funds. So if you'd like to hang out with me, I would love it if you would comment, give this a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching my video. By subscribing and watching the full video, I get to keep you as a subscriber. If you just subscribe and then flip, flip off or whatever, it doesn't count. And it also goes towards my watch hours. I'm trying to gain my monetization back. Thank you very much. For those of you who do not know, I was monetized a long time ago and I'm a nurse and during COVID, I just kind of took a break from social media um, and YouTube. They let me keep the subscribers I already had, but they took away all of my watch hours. So I have to earn that back in order to be monetized again. So I'm at like 2,670 hours maybe. I need to get to 4,000. So thank you so much for everybody who has helped me out with that. I truly, truly appreciate you and you bless me every single day. Okay, I'm a fall girl and I'm ready. I know it's not officially fall until September 23rd, but when I see September, I'm already thinking all the pumpkin things, okay? <laughs> so, so far I switched everything over already. Um, I switched my cards over, I just need to. Okay, um, so these are my just insurance cards, bank cards, whatever, whatever, whatever. I need to stuff my new envelopes. So let's go ahead and do that. So food and drink has $20 in it. So I'm going to put it into my new food and drink envelope. Now I don't need the holes at the bottom but I decided to keep them, number one, because they do fit like they are in my wallet. Um, and I never know if I ever wanna change a binder again, so I'm gonna keep that that way. Shenanigans, let's see what we have in here. Is $10 going in. Um, take my money. I did not transfer this one. This one is for like hobbies and things, but I pretty much use my spending money for this. So I have $10 here. I'm not sure what envelope I want to put it in, in my wallet so or whatever with it. So until I figure that out, I'll just set it there. I am keeping self-care. Of course, it's very important. That could be buying a candle. It can be getting my toes done, my fingers done. Um, Things like that. So we will transfer that over. Okay. Miscellaneous has $10 in it that I'm keeping. So we will put that over there. I did not make a change envelope. I just figured whatever cash I have back from that specific envelope, I'll just put it keep it in that envelope and then I can take the ones out later. One, two, three for whatever I decide to do with that. And then my personal spending left, I have $45 it looks like. So this wallet is ready to go up for this season. 20, 40, 45. I will put in my personal spending envelope. And all of these will go back into my wallet. Oh, okay. Um, change, oh, coins, do I change? I do, I'm gonna also take out gift cards and business cards and put those in my wallet somewhere. And 
I will take these out on my first cash stuffing for September. And then my gift cards and such, um, I guess I will just keep in the front here with receipts. Or I'll figure that out. That's not, that's not working well. Okay, I'll figure that out. So that is wallet change for fall. Super happy about that. Okay, my cute little box that I gave a job to. <laughs> um, I finished three savings challenges. Let's take them out and see what I saved. And I will be including in that my monthly for the month of August. That goes automatically to my 100 envelope savings challenge. I just save extra cash that I make by overtime at the hospital or selling something or making something and getting commission for it. So um, yeah, that's a really big chunk of chunk of one to do with limited money, but I'm gonna finish out the year, see where we're at and just be proud of the amount of stuffing I did. I do use fake bills in here because $5,050 is a lot to keep in the house if I were to finish it. And it can be earning interest, which it is in the high yield savings. So I haven't done this before. Normally like this, I know I'm gonna put into here. So I do have $50 off to the side in fake money. So the real cash is going to go back to the bank and I will write in that it's going into my 100 envelope challenge and then let's see what we have available um, envelope wise so we have 20 40 and 50 that we saved for the month 50 is taken, 49 is taken, 48 is not taken. So I will find 48. We will just put in the 50. Okay, so I will fold this in. I like to see the cash add up. Okay, very nice. So I might have a little extra in here and that's not gonna hurt even if I can't finish the full challenge. Um, that is fine, I'm okay with that. And I, I did that on all the 90s too, there's $100 in each of those. So I'm going to close this one up because we are done with that. And I'm going to color in the 48. So is everybody's children back to school? Off to college, starting daycare. My uh, granddaughter, Rachel, baby Rachel, two months old, just started daycare yesterday. Her mother's a hot mess. Uh, um, Nick stayed home. <laughs> they went out to, to drop the baby off, went out to breakfast, but did get reports back from um, daycare during the day with little pictures of her. And this dot just means I already... Um, switch the money out to fake bills. So that is coming along, coming along, coming along. Okay. Now, normally what I do when I have a challenge, I have it dedicated to something, but I've been seeing some people put their money together and then beefing up envelopes that they would like to round up or that just need a little extra bump or boost. And I'm going to try that this time. Normally I would say, I want this to go to travel or I want this to go to savings. So I'm just gonna put my money together. This was a cute little summer savings. It was a freebie from the Almost Organized Owl and it saved me $48. Let's just double check that. 20, 30, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 47, 48. I'm gonna put this five back here. Um, not sure what I wanna do yet, tens. Okay, 
working around my camera stand per usual. So that was $48. This cute little, I call it cute cow. It's called cash cow. It should have saved me $200. And this was by Studio 658. And we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 160, 165, 170, 175, 180, 185, 190, 195, 96, 97, 98, 99, $200. That was a fun one to do. I started that one in May and just finished it the end of August. Okay, so plus 200, we're up to 248. And then I got this gorgeous lemonade challenge from money, Making Money Moves. And it saved me $150. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 140, 145, and 150. That is spot on. So not having to recount everything, um, plus 150, $398, but because my brain just can't handle that. I'm going to take $2 that was left from my wallet exchange, and I'm going to add the $2 to that to make it I had 398 plus two, making it an even $400. I'm gonna put these aside, because um, at the end of the year, we're gonna go through all the savings challenges that I did, so I'm not going to recount this. But what I am going to do is redistribute now. So, um, I came up with some of my binders that I would like to beef up or add back a little bit. So I'm gonna, I might be going back and forth with some. Vacay getaway. I pulled some money out of here for a trip coming up in October. So let's do eight, 31, 32, 32, allocate. And it's going to get $110, which will make this 825 balance. So 100 and let's do the 10. So we have 500 in the bank, 51, so that's 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 7, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, 10, 25, 825, and that is correct. Okay, I have my little cheat sheet over here so I don't forget what I want to put into where. Um, I think we're done with this one, so I'll put that back. Uh, most of it is going to go to um, my sinking funds binder. But because of the denomination thing, I'm going to skip down to the bottom. Um, I am going to put, this is a $1,000 savings challenge that I got from Iris, from Iris Budget. She made this special for me. And when it is completed, I am going to use so I'm using some smaller savings challenges to help with my, this is still a large savings challenge, but mediocre or little compared to the this big Whopper one. So when this is full, I will take these funds, put them, stuff them into that. So she is going to get this cow binder is <clears throat> going to receive um, $150. So let me 
add these up. So that's a 10, finish up these rows, 10, 40, plus 40, 150. So we're going to finish these three rows. So let's do $10. Okay, then we're going to do another 10. Let's do some ones. Or let's do a five and five ones. One, two, three, four, and five. I think that's what I want to do. Um, we'll do this 40. And then we'll do this 10, 40, and 40. coloring job and I don't care okay <laughs> all right so we have this 40 up here okay and then we have that 40 there and then we have another 40 and another 10 so 20 40 60 80 90, 100, 20, 40, 50. All right, so now we can find these envelopes, see which ones come in first. I love this. So cute. Filling up nicely, filling up nicely. So here's a 10. So you can put the five and five ones in here. So here's another 10. Here is a 40. Here is another 40. Isn't that nice to see these 40s filling up, man? Woo! So satisfying. Here's another 40. I think I have all the 50 stuffed already. So I need one more $10. And here we go. So my other little cow savings challenges fill these up. So I finished a cow one. It went into here. So let's see what we have left to stuff in here. We have 20 plus 40 to finish that row. Then I have 20 plus 40 plus 20 plus 10. And then in this last row, I have a 10, a 20, a 10, and a 40. That should be $230. That is correct. So that's all I need before I can stuff this thousand into my 100 envelope. Yay. Okay, pulling out my sinking funds now. So adulting is taxes, can't touch this is my savings. This actually is not getting anything, but I do have in here right now, 1,487. This is my new emergency. So I really kind of wanted to bump a little into here. So we're gonna pull this out. And right, 8, 31, August, allocation, and we are going to bump 70 bucks into here, and that will put me at an equal $200. Awesome. 20, 40, 50, 55, 56, 57, 
58, 59, 60, mm, okay, 70. If I mess that up, you know, let me know. Okay. So I should have $200 in here. Let's give it a quick count. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, $200. Boom. That's how you help things out to build up faster than just $5 and $10 here. And that's how I finish those challenges by stuffing five and 10 here and there. Okay. Smile for my professional whitening once these braces come off is going to be getting um, $45. Yep. So A31, August, the location, 45. So that should put me at $200 in here as well. So let me get out $45, 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. Okay, so I should have 200. So I have 100 in the bank, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, at $200. That is correct. Love to see it. Love to see it. Okay. I'll be doing um, my cash stuffing for September soon too so you'll see the balances and all of this this is fixer upper i want to fix up my room right now saving up for flooring that's going to be the um most expensive thing and then after that i can paint and do things here and there and it's going to get twenty dollars and that will make this 350. So 100 in the, oh, 200 in the bank, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 20, 40, 50. 350 is correct. And our remaining $5, every little bit, every little bit, remaining five is going to go into Christmas. So 831. August allocation and it's getting five so that should bring it to 650 nice round number so 500 in the bank 20 40 60 86 20 40 45 and 650 and that is it everybody that is how I spent my $400 that I saved up um, in savings challenges and finished them in August. And you just watched me stuff $400 into one, two, three, four, five, six different places. And I'm very happy with that. So thank you so much for joining me. I would love to watch your videos of when you do the same. So comment below and let me know. I'll talk to you later. Bye.